So let me put the tripod aside and just show you this firsthand. Ooh wee, look at it. Can you see all of it? Oh yeah. Now I have all of these mannequins here. Look at them all. Tons of them. Now that was a lot of fun. So now that I have all this completely done, I always like to let it dry for quite a while. This has been drying for a few days just to make sure that it doesn't peel off as easy as it normally would if I didn't let it dry. So I'm going to now gloss it. Now the glaze and varnish that I usually use is here from Liquitex. The one that I had used in the past here was a glaze medium. Now, unfortunately, they're all sold out of this one here. So I had to go for the bigger one, which is fine because I'm gonna be using it a lot more with all these mannequins I have. And it is also from Liquitex, but the only difference here is one says glaze medium and the other one is glaze medium and varnish. So, I don't know if they just repackaged it. I looked at the back, everything else seems to be the exact same. So we'll soon find out. Now, some of the problems I've been having with the other ones 
that I have done is that it still seems to be able to peel. Now I'm in the midst of trying to figure out a better glaze or medium that can give this a nice gloss and shine that's not going to be able to peel or scratch off just because I want a, a more of a long-term durability. Now I know I could totally use a resin, but the thing is resin itself is very expensive. If you don't do it properly, it continuously has that sticky sensation as well as I don't want any air bubbles and to use a blowtorch on this, it's a little risky. So I'm gonna stick to this until I find anything else. And if you all have any ideas of what I can also use, please leave a comment down in the below and I will give you a shout out and it would be much appreciated if it all works out good for this kind of project here. So, let's get started. <laughs> top of that I also have this which if you haven't seen the video when I make this it's a wine bottle topper so same process except this is done on a styrofoam head I made these little makeshift ears out of polymer clay and it turned out awesome and this is a little beautiful piece I feel like and uh, it just sits on top of a wine bottle there and I will leave this video up right here so yeah and uh, it's still fully drying and curing in here I'm pretty much making all of these videos a few days apart besides the editing, you know, editing takes a long time. So this here, I'm super, super happy about and it's awesome. So this one here is no longer for purchase, unfortunately, but if anyone is interested in getting one, please let me know in the comments down below. Now this here is still drying. It's coming along nice and shiny and beautiful. So yeah, I got tons there and a few more elsewhere in my house. As well as look at mannequin legs too. So I will be doing some statues eventually here with some of these mannequin legs here. I'm gonna be putting a pole in the leg and making a big stand for that. Okay everyone, I can't say thank you enough for staying to the end of this video. And check out all my social media here to see the updates of this beautiful project as well as all this upcoming stuff too. I do leave it all on my Snapchat and my Instagram. And until next time, please like this video, subscribe, 
notification bell, all that fun stuff. You know what to do. And feel free and share it and leave a comment down below. And hey, if you're going to miss me, check out my other videos too. Okay, till next time, remember, stay ambitious. All right, see you later.